live from A Fizzle Productions. This is Monday Vibes. What's going on, everyone? A Fizzle here on this Monday, January 4th, 2021. And this is the first official episode of Monday Vibes. The first five videos you saw in regards to Monday Vibes, they were all installments. It was a preseason. This is the regular season now. Now, first things first, in regards to this week, y'all already know it's a big week for me. This is the final week of the three-week train, Christmas, New Year's, birthday. Like I stated last week, I hope everyone had a great Christmas. I'ma stay today. Hope everyone had a great New Year's. Hope you enjoyed it. I enjoyed mine. I have no problems, I have no qualms. So far, my year is off to a great start. Hopefully it'll continue on as we progress. Now, what's coming up for April of this week? Obviously, I am doing the All-American April Productions birthday stream. Obviously, I'll probably not name it that. It'll probably just be Happy 31st April or Happy 31st stream, something like that. Yeah, I will be doing that Friday night, 10 p.m. I'm gonna try to get my liquor and stuff throughout the week. It won't be today though. It'll probably be throughout the week. I'm trying to get my liquor and stuff ready. Thursday. I will be at the hangout on my actual birthday. I got the day off of work. Just don't tell anyone though. But I got the day off of work, so I'm going to turn up. And Friday, I'm going to spend it with y'all. And Saturday, I'm going to be with the family. So do not expect me to really be on YouTube that much on Saturday, if at all. I know Salito was talking about doing a live stream for the Buccaneers game. He's pretty much banking that I'm going to be there. I can't guarantee you that. Now, if you want me there Sunday for the Saints game, I can try to be that, be in that one. Other than that, I do still have to do some countdown videos. I still have to do that. I will be doing the drink review soon. I'm going to order this beer because it's not in stores here. I'm going to order it. So I got to do it for uh, Celeste. She wanted me to try the Pirate Belgian beer. But one beer I did find in stores that will be coming soon. Um, is it is orange something it is black orange blood orange bl blood orange IPA uh, Big Us and Metalhead 1990 I ran into him in T stream last week he wanted me to try that so I, I do I did find that one so I will be trying that real soon so expect two drink reviews coming soon Saturday sexy ladies part three the trilogy I actually did this back in 2017. It is revamped because I honestly did not like the uh, the other version too tough. So I'm going to redo that one. God damn, that, it is so packed over there at the bank. Thank God I do not have to go to the ATM machine today. But yeah, I'm going to premiere that Saturday at noon. So it's basically going to be the same girls you seen from 2017, that, that edition. Maybe a couple more that you didn't see. I want to give too much away on that one. And this is the final, I mean, like Michael Jackson said, this is it back in 2009. This is final concerts. Come on, go! Damn, it's gonna make me late for work. But yeah, as I was saying, this is the final, and I mean the very final installment of the Sexy Ladies Trilogy. This is it. I would not be, damn, kiss the school. But yeah, I would not be making any more Sexy Ladies after this. I feel like it's ran its course. And I want to focus on other things in 2021. So I do have that going down. Sexy ladies. I do have um, the birthday stream. And I have... I think that's it video-wise. Also, another thing I wanted to touch on. It seemed like all these shows want to either premiere or start a new season on my birthday. It's like, last couple weeks, I've been seeing commercials... Uh, coming January 7th, premiering January 7th. It's like, God damn, how many new shows coming out? And half of them are garbage, so I just find it kind of, I guess I'm honored, but I'm kind of weirded out at the same time. Like, damn, everything got to drop on the 7th, huh? So I know for a lot of y'all, y'all going to have something to watch, B. <laughs> yeah, y'all are definitely covered in those regards, so. I, got, I do got one last thing to touch on right quick. I'm starting to get annoyed by this whole road to 1K thing. Now, 
I am appreciative of all the subscribers that I have. I'm appreciative to everyone who watches my videos and enjoys my content. But for me personally, there is no road to 1K. I never came on YouTube with the intention to have the most subscribers in the world, to have a shit ton of subscribers. I always, I've always said, if I do make it to a thousand, then great. If not, I don't care, you know? I am honored for the people who watch, but it's, it's just not my goal. My goal is to drop kick-ass content and keep y'all entertained. You know, Shanette has done this. Rita's done it was the whole road to 1K thing for me. No, no, it's not It's not a road to 1K. It never was. It never will be. And plus, I feel like I'm selling out if I, if I were to do the whole road to 1K and follow through with it. It's like, damn, they feel so. So you're selling out good content to have this many subscribers. No, we're not doing that. You know, what if y'all want to say road to anything for any Filter Productions, road to Friday night. The A Fizzle Productions birthday stream. Road to Friday night. That's the new hashtag for this week. Fuck all this road to 1K shit, you know. But you know, I do you know I do appreciate y'all sharing my content and all and putting my name out in the mainstream, you know, help your guy out. So I do appreciate that. Please promote my birthday stream, if anything. I will appreciate I will that talk, very much. I will much. tell y'all something else right quick. Um, everyone who's watching, a little inspirational for the day for the week so y'all can get y'all year up to a, a great start. Only thing I would tell y'all is drop the dead weight, okay? If if you associate with somebody and you thought they were cool at first, but then you started to know the real backstory behind them, you think they're not good for your uh, psyche, for your circle, drop them, get rid of them. 2021, we would not have any dead weight this year. I'm gonna cut this off because I'm at work now. Yeah, we will not have any dead weight this year. That's how we do. You know, even as your family members, you, you got to drop them. Drop them. For real, because I like, come the fuck on, it, 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 you know, because they're just going to bring you down. And don't go looking for drama either. If, if you're not a drama person, don't go looking for it. It's not worth it. It's not worth your time. Just continue to do you, continue to stunt, continue to uh, get your paper. And do your do your thing, you know, because A Phil's gonna do his thing regardless. I'm not worrying about any team one at all. So I think that may be it. I don't think I really have much else to say. I do want to say big ups to everyone who brought with A Phil's Productions in 2000, um, 2020. I was hesitant to say in that year, but I'm very I'm I'm very honored that for one who brought with me last year. I'm very honored to meet some new people last year. I know it was a crazy fucked up year with the pandemic and all, but we made it, y'all. We made it. And now we're going to make 2021 a great year. That's the plan. Pandemic should be clearing up by then. The vaccines are already here. Which is, you know, everybody's in the business of testing them out, making sure that we're on pace to deliver them to the world instead of just let them out. So... Yeah, we got that going down. So, other than that, y'all be easy. Oh, and rest in, uh, rest in peace, Floyd Little. I almost forgot. The first great Bronco player to ever grace the uniform back in the late 60s, early 70s. He did pass away on either New Year's Day. Yeah, New Year's Day. He passed away on New Year's Day. So, rest in peace to Floyd Little. My heart goes out to his family. I did want to make sure I got that in. So, that's going to do it for today's episode of Monday Vibes. All right, now I got to get to work now. So, um, a is signing out. Y'all be easy. I'm gone. And I'll see y'all next Monday for another edition of Monday Vibes.